Hey guys, I am back to weekend vlogging. I took a couple weeks off. Um, not much was going on. And actually the past two weeks and still now, Dan has been really sick. He's had the flu. Um, so he's just really didn't run down. So we haven't really been doing much. Um, just been taking it easy. So there wasn't too much to vlog. People have been commenting, oh, we miss your vlogs. And I was like, I do miss vlogging. I miss getting to talk to you and sharing what's going on and yeah, so I was like, even though it's not that much going on today, it's Friday, but I was like, and it's already evening because I had worked all day. Um, so it's about six o'clock, just go home from work. But I was like, oh, I still wanna to talk to you. So, um, update about Chloe. She's been on her anti-seizure medication for a month and a half now. And about two weeks ago, we increased it because she was still having seizures. And it seemed to be going well, and then she's had three seizures this week. She had one on Sunday night, one Monday night, and then one yesterday afternoon, Thursday. So things are obviously not going well. So um, I was talking to the doctor today, who's been also talking to the specialist, um, who like did her MRI and stuff. And so we have a new plan for her. She's getting a blood test today done, and depending on the results for that, then we may do another blood test and then if those both come negative then we're going to put her on a new medication or another medication for anti-seizures and hopefully that'll help if not then it's probably not epilepsy and then we're going to do a spinal tap but that's about 1500 bucks so hoping we don't have to go that route but obviously i will if that's what's needed um oh, Chloe. Chloe. Oh, Chloe. you're not so close Tripsy's like, I'll come say hello. <laughs> um, no, Clay's just doing her own thing. Hi, Trips. No, she laughed. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to be taking her down to the vet hospital for lab work. Um, but I'm going to take them for a walk, too. I was thinking of going for a run today, but then now with taking Chloe to lab work, I probably won't. Um, and then thinking what to have for dinner dinner. I have so much like stuff in my pantry that I honestly have to start using food up. So yeah, it's, it's been, it was Dan's birthday yesterday or the day before. So we've been going out for dinner and for brunch and stuff. So yeah, I've been having lots of leftovers from restaurants, but <laughs> I was like, you know, I have to start using up food that I had originally bought as well. Anyways, so a very long three minute introduction to Friday vlogging. Are you guys in the pool? What you doing, Chloe? You just walked in there on your own? <laughs> Hi! Hi, honey! Hi! Hi, Molly! <laughs> it's not even that hot. Oh my god! I fell in the pool. <laughs> it's actually not too hot right now. Sometimes at like 6.30 it is warm, but it's, yeah, it's not that bad. It's warm, but not hot. <laughs> we usually go in the pit over there, but there's so much spear grass, which is like, well, it's like, yeah, grass that's dried and it has like bars that, barbs that just go in and don't come out. So anyways, Molly, do not go, Molly! not go in the playing field <sighs> anyway so yeah I'm just avoiding it as you can see all the dried grass in there that's all spear grass so come on trip trip so you guys will have to settle with just playing on this grass <laughs> see this is spear grass and that's still green so it's not that bad but this one and they get even drier than that. And like, anyways, yeah, so they're little barbs and they really, it sucks. At the vet about, well, once it gets dry and stuff, about once a week we see at least one spear grass case. Um, usually it's stuck in, um, just got a deer leash, um, between their toes or um, like in their ear. We've had some in their eye. We had one that was, um, 
a female dog that kept licking her, you know, her vulva, and the owner thought, oh, was there an infection? Nope, there was a piece of spear grass stuck up in there. Um, we've had ones that were in dog's third eyelid. Uh, anyways, it's terrible, and if you don't catch it, it just gets worse and worse, so I make sure after all my walks, I check the dogs between their paws and everywhere, and that's why it's nice that Chloe's all, or no, that Tripsy's all groomed, um, because it's easier to see, but yeah, spear grass, terrible. So now we're just hanging out by the air conditioner. Tripsy's off back there doing her own thing, but the air is coming right here. It's just one of those ones that's near the, it goes out the window. Got it from Costco, I think two years ago, but anyway, so yeah, we're all just So for dinner, we are going to be sharing a salad that I took to work last, oh no, just on Thursday, it's not even that long ago, um, and then I didn't eat it, so I brought it home. So now I'm having it. Um, and then also saw edamame beans. Ooh, with kind of the sweet and salty <laughs> sauce. Sweet and spicy sauce. So now we're at the vet hospital. Coco, how are you? We're gonna have some blood work done. So since it is an emergency hospital as well, um, there was just so they said two emergencies came in they're expecting another one to come any minute and they even had like an animal stretcher out so they're like you're looking at about a couple hour wait and just for her to get lab work it's not worth it so i'm like okay we'll come back tomorrow so uh, but the vet hospital just happens to be right by home sense so that's what we're gonna do now it's not hot or anything so coco's gonna stay in the car we won't be long <laughs> we're looking for a teapot because i don't have he thinks I should get like the typical brown ones. I do not want one of those. This is a pretty one. I love this one. But apparently that's too small for two people. <laughs> those are cute though. Yeah. We get all brown and stained on the inside. But it's a wide opening so you can wash it. Easily. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I like that that one comes with a infuser. It's almost too modern looking. Then if we're gonna have one that has an infuser, we might as well go to David's Tea and get one of their cool, cute ones. Hint, hint, birthday. It's back home now. We didn't get anything from HomeSense, but it's just fun watching. Uh, so now we are going to just watch some episodes on TV, or like the show episodes with Matt LeBlanc. Um, yeah, I think we started watching it, or Dan had already seen most of it, but I started watching it on Netflix, binge-watched over the course of a couple weeks, so now we're almost all caught up to, well, we're all caught up on Netflix, and now we're just watching the real time, so, yes, that's gonna be the rest of our evening, um, and that's gonna be it, so thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys tomorrow, bye.